YouTube, what's up, baby? It's your boy Kenny Wayne back again with another review, another reaction. Today we got Playboy Cardi's Double XL 2017 Freshman Freestyle. We about to check right in with Young Cardi, Cash Cardi. Let's see what you got, boy. I'm actually interested to see what this nigga says and how he come on this motherfucker. Let's go. Mm. Yeah, hiding in my sock, hiding in my sock, ooh, staring every rock. First I park my car, uh, then I put a walk. Uh, I'm a watch star, uh, I'm a pop star. Hey. I've heard. Is that on Magnolia? That's is that Magnolia? Them the first few bars. Pop a lot of beef. Hey. She just on the team. Hey. She would wanna feel. Oh, bro, I gotta start all over. My bad. Mm. Yeah, hiding in my sock, hiding in my sock, ooh, staring every rock. First I park my car, uh, then I put a walk. Uh, I'm a watch star, uh, I'm a pop star. Ay. Pop a lot of beef, ay. she just on the tee, ay. she just want a fiend, uh, she just want a drink. Ay. I just got a new hoe, that's my favorite bitch. Ay. Bruh, Cardi is one of those rappers where he, you gotta put him on a beat. Like that shit gotta be a fucking song. Like, niggas like Cardi not cut for acapella like this with no fucking beat. He ain't got bars like that. Like, he good at writing beats. So, if this was, like, behind a, a South Side or some beat, or um, what's his name, Pierre or whatever, this should be fire, but I don't know. I feel like he one of the rappers that got to be behind a beat. Because the beat speaks for him, and he just ride that motherfucker. Pause. This nigga got a new watch. Diamonds on my wrist. Hey, yeah. Hey, nigga, watch this. Hey, LV's on. He ain't ready for this, like... This uh, this ain't him. This ain't he ain't ready for that. That's too much pressure. Uh, Kim Jones in my line had to plug up. Hey, all you hoes want to fuck cause I'm money up. Hey, count all this cash, got a nigga money tight. Hey, nigga ain't right, then the nigga getting fired. I don't really fight, nigga hit him where he lying. Hey, Hell no. Stop the cap and stop the line. Nah, he wasn't. He wasn't really cut for that cloth right there, bro. That might have been too much. He's to he's better he's better on the beat, like I said. Honestly, bro, that might be the worst one that I saw. Like, I didn't really like A Boogies. It was cool. Um, and P and B Rocks was cool. They were both fucking songs written again. But Cardi shit was definitely worse than both of uh, A Boogies and uh, P and B's, bro. But hey, I'm not saying um, A Boogies and P and B's was whack. I'm just saying that Cardi shit is worse than this. Like, Cardi shit, this shit was type way whack. This is definitely the weakest one. And I thought it I thought it was going to be better. I don't know why I thought I did, but looking like looking back into it, he's really a, a nigga who, he doesn't have bars. Like, when you listen to Cardi, you're not there for the bars. You're there for the vibe. You feel me? It's just a vibe. And that nigga just be riding the shit out of beats. So, like I said, I'm not surprised that this shit was trash, but... Cardi, bro, I expected it to be better, but it is what it is. Hopefully, you could bounce back on the fucking cypher or something. Because you went out, you definitely went out bad on this motherfucking freestyle. That shit was not all that, but I still fucks with you. Anyway, this is your boy, Kenny Wayne. This is a, a fucking reaction. Yo, don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. Let me know what you fucking think about this Cardi freestyle. Did you fuck with it? Did you think that shit was trash? Did you like it? Do you think that... I don't fucking know. Write whatever the fuck you want to write. And that's that. Sicko.